Hello, people of the internet. This is Joe from the Wind, bringing you a Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Yeah, I don't really, I'm not even gonna say that anymore, even though I say that every time. Dude, gosh, I keep on saying that. But Birdman FDW gave me this gameplay. I got a flash drive of a bunch of his gameplay, so the next six, seven commentaries of mine will actually actually be sent in by Birdman FDW to go subscribe to him. I think you guys all know him because that that's what. You guys probably all know him anyways, but uh, I will, probably won't put a link in the description because you guys probably know him. Um, yeah, so anyways, this is Joven for the win, and I'm bringing you basically an F the Community episode number two, but not really F the Community. I'm just pissed because this morning, you know, there's a lot of ways to complain about driving and drivers and how terrible they are, and I could go off on a rant about just about every single thing about driving about all the stupid moves that people do but you know that that's kind of regular but this morning I witnessed something that was just completely out of my mind but or put me out of my mind I don't even know what the term is who cares who cares who screw grammar um yeah I screw phrases I don't like phrases okay guys I don't like phrases. I just like to use them and sound sophisticated. Well, I know that I'm wrong because that's what I do. But anyways, so first you have to know something about my school. We were driving to school. My my sister drives me to school along with some other fruitcakes. So basically, uh, the road upcoming to the school onto the well, bef we have to turn right to get into the school. Well, no. You can turn right to get into the school if you want to go that way, but we park somewhere else um, at, by a baseball field, basically. So, essentially, what you have to do is turn right and then turn right into the school right there, but then you have to go all the way around the school. You can't just go, um, for, go out from where you enter from, which is kind of stupid, but I guess it's better for traffic. So, instead, you have to go do an entire loop. And there's a right-hand turn lane, so you turn right into the school. So, it's in this right-hand turn lane where some people uh, drop off people, or you can go all the way around, but typically, people will drop people off there, usually parents and stuff. And, you know, that's normal. That's all normal. But, it might, it might be a little upsetting that you have to go all the way around for the parent after you drop them off, which, I mean, that makes sense. But, just go along with the flow. I mean, get over it. You're dropping your child off. I mean, that's that's the idea of the entire situation. You should be prepared to uh, waste a lot of time in traffic because there's a lot of traffic. But no, people decide to do the stupidest things just to avoid traffic. And this lady, I, she stops in the right-hand turn lane and waits and drops off like four people out of the car so then they can just walk on the sidewalk and walk to school I was right behind this and somebody else was looking to turn right right in front of us so they were starting to turn right and then they started to slow down and we started to slow down too because we were like what the frick and then he, since they're just stopped there the guy had to go around so we had to slow like almost completely stop and then the guy right in front of us had to go left and then turn right back into the right turn line. And I'm like, are you freaking kidding me? That is crazy. Why would you stop in a right-hand turn lane to drop people off? That is just uh, that is just crazy. And I was astonished. Like, literally, I just sat there, like, mouth wide open. I was just like, what the frick was that for? I'm just like, lost faith in humanity right there. I was pissed. I was pissed. I mean, I understand... Sometimes it's annoying when people uh, freaking drop people off like in the middle of a parking lot, like in the park while you're right behind them and you have to wait for them. That's slightly annoying. But to drop somebody off in a right-hand turn lane while you are completely stopped in a busy area where there is a high chance, higher chance of there being a collision due to that fact, you must be out of your mind. And I was just pissed. I was pissed. I was like, well, we could have been in an accident. The guy in front of us could have hit that car. Or he could have pulled over to the left, not seeing us, and crashed into us. Therefore, causing us to go in the oncoming lane of traffic. Therefore, causing us to get in a crash. And then the car in the oncoming lane of traffic could also rear-end the car in the oncoming lane of traffic. So that would be just like a freaking five-man multi-kill right there. That would be crazy. Just due to one stupid bitch. Who decided to drop their kids off at a red turn, a right turn line? 
because she's lazy. She wasn't fat though, so I mean, typically fat, stereotypical, stereotypically fat people are going to be lazy. But I mean, obviously, maybe when you're driving a car, you might have a different circumstance where you might not be as lazy. You might maybe skinny people are more lazy while driving a car, while fat people would be less. Aha, uh -huh, less lazy while driving a car because if you think about it, fat people aren't going to be want to want to get out of the car for a long time because I mean then they have to stand up. While skinny people, they they're perfectly fine and um they just wait. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. I don't know. Just pissing me off. Anyways, any commentary topics because I feel like I've just been raging and then talking about Yasha Mishima. And I can't really think about doing commentaries that much during school. So if you have any good commentary topics, let me know. Let me know, guys. I mean, I don't want to be that commentator who's like, Well, guys, if you would like me to talk about some stuff, I really haven't ever done that. But if you, if you guys want to hear something, let me know because it's kind of tough. I actually have a lot of videos stored up and stuff. But thank you guys for watching. Audio Troll Ties Friday. Look forward to it. Bye.